Well, let's let's stay with our game plan. Okay. And I know you've got some things you want to raise. And okay. uh, at some point, we'll get a quiet moment. Okay. We'll would, you, would you like to uh, go inside? Uh, we could take you in, but I'm just being frank with you. But, uh, they're doing work right now. And, uh, I don't. I don't want to interfere like, with their work. Won't yeah, be, it won't be a question of interference. It's just a question. Of, you know, you have to understand it. But it's not going to be the most pleasant over. I understand. No, I think we have uh, some briefing time. Am I right? That's yes, correct. Sir. Yes, we've got about five, ten minutes. Do uh, you want to share anything with the lieutenant governor on the operation? And then we're going to go out to the crash site. And, yes, sir. But, but the full of briefing that had been discussed is here or there? It's going to be at the crash site. The, uh, the guard would like to uh, uh, share what they've been uh, doing in terms of their support for the operation on the corner. Gotcha. Uh, for his folks and the d folks. Gotcha. Okay. 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 So we can rely on you to kind of lead the footsteps sure. here? All right. Do we want to go into an office in here? Do you want to tour the actual facility? Is it, is well, no, leave it up if they're, to you. I, I think Joe like nailed it. it. They're underway. Let, keep yeah. that going. Sure. Let, let's get some uh, quiet we'll, time with you folks. We'll be a distraction, quite frankly. I would, I would say I would that's probably true, but you know what I mean? No, you get a lot of money. your auspices eventually, ultimately. Yeah. If you feel confident, I feel completely confident that we have the absolute best team that could possibly assemble. When the Deedmore team got activated, that was the answer to my prayers. And prior to that, I had just been kind of working on an ad hoc basis. So when did they arrive? Uh, the second day. The second day. Uh, we, had, we had a little bit of problem with uh, the federal, uh, right. the federal people. Due to the fact that it's an FBI crime scene that changed the whole scenario. Sure. Uh, that, so what was, what was able to happen finally, they were able to get the different team to come in as an FBI subcontractor. Gotcha. And they're going to handle all the DNA testing, which is going to be the main component. Well, let me make a suggestion here. Let, let's get a couple minutes in here with you uh, quietly where we can. And uh, we can say thanks and acknowledge the folks who have been cranking since Tuesday. And then we're going to be on our way. Okay. Do you want me to bring a representative out from the work or something? Don't interrupt the work. Okay. Do you have a place in mind where you want to have the conversation? Or? Uh, sure. Yeah. Yeah. We'll follow you then. Yeah. Yeah. One, one, one. Sure, the ID work is done. That's well. So you're talking about security of all that. Just as you've been extremely busy, and I, I can see the fatigue in your eyes as well as your dedication, and we're, we're, we're grateful for that. Uh, you can imagine with responsibilities in Washington and in uh, Manhattan. He's a busy boy too, but uh, he, he uh, insisted on getting out here as quickly as he can. And I, I, I said to him, before we go out to the crash site, let's uh, look these folks in the eyes and, and say thank you for what you've done. And I think Joe wants to. I appreciate everything that you're doing. Just to be confident elsewhere at the other sites, you have compadres of like spirit doing exactly the same thing. This is, a, this is a tough time, but we'll all get through it. We have a strong spirit. That's what this country is founded on. Thanks so much for what you're doing. Yeah, we appreciate that. All right. So, uh, you okay? so far, so you nice. well, 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 How you feeling? Yeah. And you How you feeling? Yeah. So thank you guys. Thank you, there. Yeah, thank you. It's the best yeah, we can stay out of trouble. <laughs> Thanks for being Appreciate the effort, too. Thanks very much. Thank you. 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 You can do that, right? How's that? Let me teach you something here. Like oh, that. oh. <laughs> there, I'll get to you. Good enough. What you doing? Hey, wonderful work. I know you're uh, really cranking. We appreciate it. I'm Tom with United, and you got a great state here. Thank you. Everybody here has been great. Unbelievable. Thank you. That's just, uh, these are challenging times. Yes, they are. Mm -hmm. They're doing well. I see some goodies here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. See Thank you. you. You're welcome to stay for lunch. Well, we've got ourselves a schedule. Okay. These men deserve pretty much of the credit for this. Tough work. Yeah, a little bit. But it's important. It is important.
uh, standpoint of the families and showing that that's, uh, we're providing dignified care. We're providing our whole thrust of this operation is for that because we feel we have families. That's the way I've operated my life. This is my career and I'm trying to continue that way. And that's, that's where we're going. That's you have been. I'm trying to. Steady Eddie right here. Mm -hmm. Considering uh, uh, the tallness of this order. Mm -hmm. It's good knowing there's people like you behind us. We couldn't be proud of what the guard can do so promptly uh, when called upon. Uh, How are you? Fine. Thank you very much. Good to see you. Appreciate the effort. Right. Right. Let me introduce you to Joe Alba, who is the director of FEMA. Joe Alba. Very good. Good to see you. Nice to meet you. Uh, the two majors you. have been uh, responsible for, uh, you know, in-field movement and support. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I appreciate Thanks that. Thank class. you so much. And then we provide limited logistical support, uh, basically with tenant treatment meetings, and then we've also provided some support at the uh, media site with Salvation Army, the Red Cross, are set up with one of our tents, several tables, and chairs, and they're feeding basically the latest work in the media site. Can you just give us a little bit more information about the facility with the numbers of people that normally are here? We're going to increase the number of people on shifts through the facility to maintain it. Let me tell you something. I've heard nothing but positives. As far as uh, the reaction and the, your comportment and what you've accomplished, man. So you guys ought to be proud. We're not done. Far from it. This is I just said to this folks a minute ago. This is kind of like third and one in a football context, man. Just it's been challenging. I know it may feel overwhelming at times. We we got a few more yards to push in order to show the the country and uh, people like Joe that this state can uh, crank it and get it done. Doing a great job. And you have it for what you're doing. Yeah, I'm going to tell you something, uh, Joe. These folks, uh, you know, I, I, I truly could not have counseled the governor uh, as far as effective action and uh, the right thing to do without people like General Lynch, uh, these folks, uh, Colonel Ivanko, the, the commissioner of the state police, the top dog over there, and others that are here because, hey, you know, my, I see my job is to kind of remove the bureaucracy mm -hmm. so that they, they can do their work. Sure. And uh, they helped me do all that, and I've done it sure. uh, admirably. So, Thanks for your help. Solid work, Thanks gentlemen. Thank Keep you, it going, sir. okay? We right. appreciate it. Thank you, sir. I know these are sir. tough times. Have a good day, sir. Thank, Thank you. Job. I hear nothing yep. but good stuff. But Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. It ain't easy, I know it, so keep pumping it. Thanks. Thank you. Let me say thank you. I just mentioned to these folks uh, just a minute ago, you've done outstanding work. I don't want to walk away without a you know, speak to the governor. Uh, we couldn't do this without you. All right? Okay. <laughs> Okay. So when we get out of the door and stop, we're going to take